hey guys welcome back to next gen blog and in this video i want to show you how to move keyframes in blender now it's actually super easy to move keyframes in blender so without further delay let's get started and see how you can do this now before i show you how you can move keyframes first let's talk about why you need to move keyframes well you need to move keyframes to adjust the timing of your animation timing is a very crucial aspect of any animation and you need to move the keyframes to adjust it having said that let's now see how you can move keyframes now as you can see i already have a cube present in the 3d viewport so let me first create a small animation so let's say let me move this cube from this position to this particular position right here now to do that first press the letter i on the keyboard to insert a keyframe at the first frame in the timeline next move the cursor to somewhere around let's say the 60th frame and now let's move the cube from this position to this particular position so to do that press the letter g on the keyboard to grab the cube and now press the letter y on the keyboard to activate the y axis and now move the cube along the y axis like this and once you're satisfied with the position simply press enter on the keyboard perfect now let's complete the animation by pressing the letter i on the keyboard once again and this will insert a second keyframe at the 60th frame all right so now if i play the animation for you so as you can see the animation starts at the first frame and ends at the 60th frame which means this cube is taking a total of 60 frames to move from this position to this particular position now let's say i want to move this cube at a much faster pace what do i do then well you need to decrease the space between these two keyframes to make this cube move at a much faster pace and the way you do that is by moving this second keyframe from 60 to let's say somewhere around 30 so to move this second keyframe what you need to do is you need to first select this keyframe and now press the letter g on the keyboard to grab the keyframe and now move the keyframe like this and place it at the 30th frame and now press enter on the keyboard and that's it and so now if i play the animation once again this time as you can see the cube is moving at a much faster pace than how it was moving previously and that's because this time it is taking only 30 frames to move from this position to this particular position unlike previously when it was taking 60 frames so this is how you can move keyframes to adjust the timing of your animation you can also do the reverse of what we just did so let's say i want to make this cube move at a much slower pace in that particular case what we will do is we will select this keyframe and now we will press the letter g on the keyboard to grab this keyframe and now we will move this keyframe from 30 to let's say somewhere around 90 and now press enter on the keyboard and now if i play the animation as you can see this time the cube is moving at a much slower pace because we increased the space between the first keyframe and the second keyframe and that's it this is how you can move keyframes in blender do let me know your thoughts in the comment section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see you in the next video till then thanks for watching